morning girls. The sun is out today. Woo. Good morning. Lately when we wake up, there's more sun in the room. The sun is out and it's lovely because we wake up and it's bright in here and our, our eyes shift towards the window to see if it's a gorgeous day. And luckily today it is, which makes us feel like spring is right around the corner. And it is. Oh, it's great to wake up to sun. Take no break till the morning light. We all got things to do. Since we put walls up in here, I haven't missed a day making our bed. It brings me so much joy. I didn't realize that making a bed was art. Is spring really here? It feels like it is. It said that 10 minutes of the sun on your face is better than a cup of coffee. I'll still do both though. <laughs> Nothing really says good morning like espresso. Coffee is an absolute essential in this household. We've been drinking drip coffee and we just came back to espresso because it feels like a new season. After years of escaping winter by heading south in our van, we are embracing the changing season. With spring around the corner and many renovations later, we've almost made it through the harsh Canadian winter. It's negative one today, but because we've just endured negative 40, negative 20, that negative one feels like spring. Staying this winter is really going to make us appreciate the spring. When we got back from Mexico last spring, I was like, it's cold here, I don't like it. And everyone was like, oh my gosh, it's so beautiful that spring's here. And I was like, this is not spring. So I'm very happy to feel this feeling that they were all feeling last year because you really don't take any single moment of the weather for granted this way. We've been stoking the fire so much less now with the warmer weather coming. I have to say I'm going to miss stoking this fire because it's just such a vibe looking at fire. It's a big one. This isn't going to be the only fire we're starting today. <laughs> I'll make cashew cheese. It's all sticky to my You're bone. obsessed. Mm -hmm. There's nothing like rock hard toast because it takes longer to film your meal than make your meal. <laughs> Isn't that true? <laughs> so good. Rock hard. You know what I'm loving so much about this day already? I'm still in my PJs. <laughs> Feels good to slow down. The best days are full days in PJs. Can you make it that long? No, you can't. I can. <laughs> I can sit in my PJs for 365 days out of the year. <laughs> All right, move over, chair. How wide are you thinking? How, or how tall? Or long? Any ideas? Something comfortable for a wall set. Let's do your best wall set. You've been practicing. Go, girl, go. Should I mark she it? Burns, she baby. burns, <laughs> What's your vision? Tall and skinny or like short? Short and do long. Do you want to draw it out? Short. Really? Yeah, man. That big? So I can sit on it. You want to sit on it. My brain didn't communicate with your brain, and I got a vision. And Krista don't want to see my vision. Sorry. I thought it would be cute to make something like that, like that you can put stuff on top. Yeah, like my butt. Why? Because then I was going to put that basket on top of the, what we're building, and then it was going to be good. Huh. Welcome to Woodworking with Jasmine and Crystal <laughs> in the Woodworking Chat. Just kidding, I have no idea what I'm saying right now, but <laughs> we're building something out of wood, so it seemed appropriate. And you know, we're just winging it, and it's gonna look good, I think. And it's something Jasmine's been talking about for a really long time, so we're gonna see it come to life in this vlog. 
is not only is it functional, it's aesthetically cool. And in this project, we are going to be learning a new skill, which is what we're all about here. So win, 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 win. Win. Win, 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 win. She was a skater boy. She said, see you later, boy. He wasn't good enough for her. Now she's a superstar. It's a lemon on her guitar. And all this is a little hint of what's to come. Perfect. This is a project I have been so excited to start. However, I'm starting it on the week of health, where we don't focus entirely on building, but we take it slow and we enjoy the simple things and show you all a different side of life out here in the woods. Bye bye work pants. And hello shorts. Man, I miss this outfit. At first is 20 seconds of arm circle. Press start to begin. This week is about bringing all of you along with us for every little moment. <sighs> My weights are a little uneven. We may have had spaghetti last night. And focusing on balance, which is something that is very important to both Crystal and I. Next is 10 reps of bench dip. If it is too challenging with straight legs, bend them to make How long can you hold a plank for, everyone? The longest is six minutes. I, however, was 17 years old. Substanding so balance, reverse toe tap. Not too good at the backwards ones. Yes, I'm holding nails, framing nails. As much as I can't stop thinking about this, this, I feel so good that I just started my day with some movement. My legs are honestly jello. I just had a cool down and I stood up. Oh my goodness. Framing nails are no joke. You can make weights out of anything. Crystal, you won't believe it. It's a false spring. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, Goodbye my, my friend. friend. I'm over winter. I'm gonna be completely honest with you all right now. I am over winter. We're fools. That's what you call. And it's not even April. That's what you call a fool. Not a cool fool's joke. Nature. Welcome to the Arctic. <laughs> There's a smile. This is so fun. <laughs> I'm having a great time making the best of what life's given you. <laughs> We're trying to make clearing off these panels part of our routine because guess what everyone? This system is about to be set up and I cannot wait. <laughs> Taking care of business on winter day. Taking care of business. It's always a little bit intimidating to get started when you're looking out from the warm cabin, but then you get out here and you end up having a great time. And before we know it, all of these duties are gonna be over in a blink of an eye and summer's gonna be here. We're gonna be sweating our butts off. <laughs> oh, it's so cute! No. <laughs> that makes shoveling the deck worth it, eh? Oh yeah! Lucky you! That was awesome! <laughs> don't worry, Spring! We don't need ya! <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Come on, babe! Woo! Move over, Summer! We're fine with <laughs> it's so funny. Your boardwalk is ready, my queen. She's taking care of business every day. Taking care of business. Should I just start moving out here? Feel good. Feel good. <laughs> you have fun. One damn good way to get through a cold winter day. Oh yeah. Look at the door. <laughs> Bella. <laughs> Bella, you don't want to come in she here. She just scratched to get in. Hey, she don't see us. Hello. When that heats up, it's going to be a one special treat. Especially after everything we're doing today. Hello. 
Hey, girl. Also, I think I should just comment on the fact that everyone... Oh, did I just pull my hat off? There's nothing worse than that. Yeah, you look funny. I just wanted to say that we are getting a new wheelbarrow soon. A gorilla cart one. When we can find them. Because I know this is not ideal, but it's just really big and easy to move. It keeps us young. Keeps us young. Let's go. Let's go. Go, you little UTV, go. Holy sh**. Damn. It was cold a minute ago, not no more. <laughs> There's always so much to do living in the woods, but the glorious part of it all is you're on your own schedule. You can do it whenever you want until you have no kindling left. Then you better get going. <sighs> I have to say, this year we've really become experts at starting fires. Off Gritters 101, we've gotten really good at this process, you know? No joke out here. We're a real woods woman. I love it. It's so fun. It's all such a process and it's really nice to understand it all and have it all down. I know you might have some some of you might be thinking, oh it's so simple, but a lot of people don't actually know how to do all this stuff. I can't sure. let you go. I did more than that. <laughs> We're bringing you along on our workouts today. Stick my head out the window. I'll fly wherever the wind blows. Moon walking on the rainbow. That's time. where I'll be. You go, girl. You go, girl. We have completely different personalized workouts that were created just for us by our coaches at Copilot. Come on, lift that arm higher. <laughs> Hold it a little longer. Come on. <laughs> Lady. <laughs> Leslie has me doing push-ups again this week. We're talking accountability ooh, and support from real people. That's how I stay consistent. I believe in you. Breathe. When I started, I could hardly do I one. When we met our coaches, we had an onboarding call where we got to know each other. I let her know about all the sports I used to play and how I want high intensity workouts. However, I told her that my job was very labor intensive and therefore we decided to settle on working out three times a week to make a tangible goal that we can achieve. <laughs> We talked about past injuries. My ankle's still pretty weak. And what exercise equipment we had available. For us, that's spaghetti sauce. Workout number one. Let's hope I don't drop them because they are glass jars. Honestly, I've been getting very crafty with my exercise equipment lately. Copilot is designed to make you consistent. That's the focus. And guess what? For the first time in forever, I am. I used to love going to the gym. I used to love going to yoga classes. Leslie incorporated stretching into my routine. And for the first time ever, I'm doing Pilates. I'm super proud of myself. Growing up, I was an athlete. I even played college ball. So I guess when I was in my 20s, I was very athletic and I could pick up my athletic abilities at any given moment. The other day I ran to the mailbox and it was challenging. I honestly didn't make it all the way there without a break or five, which made my heart really sad. And that's why I'm so happy to be working out again. 30 second rest coming up. After reflecting, I realized that part of my athletic abilities came from having a coach. And that's why when I met Heidi for the first time, I told her I wanted her to be tough on me, just like my coaches were back in the day. Co-pilot's clients are nine times more successful at sticking to their goals. And I'm one of them and you can be too. We've left a link in the description for you. Go.mycopilot.com forward slash fanwives for you to give it a shot. You'll have a free trial with your own expert fitness and health coach. Damn, I love the butterfly stretch. 10 seconds left. I totally understand that. I think it's so great that you're listening to your body. That's my coach, Heidi. So if you followed along, a couple weeks ago, we laid drywall on this ceiling. Drywall is very heavy, so I told my coach, I can only get one workout in this week, not three, because my body honestly needed a break. And that's just how flexible Copilot is. You communicate with your coach what's going on in your life, because we all have things going on all the time. That easy. How amazing is that? A real person. This, she's real. Good work. Good work. Team. <laughs> Getting strong. <laughs> 
Thank you to Copilot for sponsoring this video. So cold out. I gotta get in here. Come in! There's no better way to enjoy a winter day than in a pipe and hot sauna. <sighs> Welcome! Oh my darling Did you hear me calling? I knew you'd pluck that from one day It really does feel good to slow down and put ourself first instead of the build always first. It's hard to do that because obviously we have tunnel vision and we just want to build, 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 but you need to refill your cup. That's what we're doing. It feels so good. You know, I wish I could share this heat with you. And if you're in a sunny place in the world, share it with all of us. There's literally a blanket of snow out there, everyone. And we're warm in here, in a barrel. <laughs> Luxury. It feels so good to take the time to do these things. It feels really good to rest and just, sometimes your body's just asking for it and you just gotta say, hey buddy, I hear ya. Yeah, I think drywall really put us out of commission for a bit, eh? <laughs> Still on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Canadian girl. Oh, can not talk. Please stand. Oh, God. I can't sing anymore. <laughs> Regret. Just kidding, I love it. How does that feel? Honey, don't hide your face from me. Honey, don't hide your face from me. How does water make you feel? Amazing. Drink up. Okay, I want Get one. your own banana. Bella wants a bite too. Good girl. Yes. You get a banana. Will you eat banana from that? You lick banana. Take a bite. Bite it. Have some banana. Good girl. Oh yeah, good bite. Yeah, bite. Yeah, get bite. It. Like a bone. Bite. Why are you being so gentle to a banana and you bite everything else? Okay, back to the video. Oh, good morning, everyone. I'm starting with lots of water. We're in different outfits for a few reasons. I'm making Crystal a runway. Is gonna fly away. Oh, I was thinking you're gonna model. Deserve a high five? Cause you're doing it. You're doing <laughs> I'm it. Doing it. Here we go. I used to be a runner, baby. You know who loves to run with me? You Bella. <laughs> this is only my third run. And I decided I was gonna wear running shoes this time. I went to the garage to dig them up. <laughs> These are two different shoes. I gotta go back. <laughs> I'm already defeated. <laughs> Got the right shoe? Yeah, girl. Hey, Leslie, going for a run. It's ain't a race. You know that? Is that a race? No. I was getting a nice shot of you. Just do my best out here. I'm a cameraman. <laughs> You're also my snowplow. Yeah. You're probably wondering, how the heck are you gonna run into those little shoes on a wintry day when the ground's covered in snow? Well, we're gonna show you. It's cold. Are you ready? Ready. All for you. Jasmine's made me a beautiful runway to get my runners on and, and it makes me so happy to be doing these things again and to be taking care of ourselves. This week just is a complete reflection. Time to slow down, relax, eat well, drink water, exercise and move our body because all these things make us so happy. These are great habits to get into as spring is around the corner. These runs will get better. My younger self, the runner I used to be, He's happy I'm picking it back up. To be honest, if I didn't have my lovely coach Leslie at Copilot, I probably wouldn't be going out for my run this morning. But I'm being held accountable, and a little bit of an encouragement goes a long way. Izzy is also adorably happy to be running with her mom. I have never plowed this amount of snow before in my life. Woo! Good work, good work. Woo, I'm sweating now. Proudy. Good job, line. Thanks. You crushed it. <laughs> you made a damn good path, girl. <laughs> good run. I'm so happy. So happy right now. 
This is gonna be life changing. It's about time and we're so excited. Over a year ago, we had a drilled well drilled here at the cabin and now we finally got our water tested. Turns out that we have very high iron and even arsenic. Both arsenic and iron are elements that are found in the earth. They are completely natural. However, they can be harmful to humans. Our arsenic is a metal. It's naturally prevalent in the earth's crust and it's more concentrated around these areas. Water will naturally dissolve the arsenic that's in the ground and then it basically comes in through the water supply. Tyler! Tyler the science guy! Tyler! <laughs> Tyler! <laughs> After a year of sourcing our water from a spring an hour away, we are moments from clean and reliable drinking water at the cabin. And we couldn't be more excited. Doing that thing we do, you know? Every day! Every day! Time to power the water filters, start the well pump with the generator, turn the water on, attach the makeshift drain pipe. We'll fix that in the summer. With the help of our new friend Tyler, we've installed the necessary filters to make the water safe and we're brought one step closer to a sustainable homestead. Thank you! Thank you. Can we just take into consideration that in a couple cycles we have iron-free, arsenic-free water and it's purified, clean, ready to wash, drink, and everything else that we want to do with the water. <laughs> water dance! I'm so excited! Woo! Woo! One step closer! Just peace of mind. I like, know, eh? so much peace of mind. It's such a yeah. great feeling. I've been wanting this for so long. So grateful to have this. Step wow. by step, everyone. Step by, by step. step. Ooh, Ooh baby. baby! The time has finally come. My favorite project is starting now. <laughs> Let's hope I still like it because the wife has made a couple of modifications to my vision. And you're all probably wondering, are you just building a plywood box? Uh-uh! Hold up, hold on, it's gonna get a lot better. <laughs> I actually like the height, I just don't like the width. It's not wide if it was low, it's wide and tall. All that really matters is we didn't make it too small. Ready? All right, moment of truth, much more of a vibe. Yeah, you might be right. The wife is always right! Okay, I think Crystal has a point of what it looks like. I thought it was gonna obstruct a view being taller, but it's more of the space. I'm catching the drift now. You ready to go get this stuff in the garage? Yeah. I'm so excited for this. Oh! Right here we have the components to make a paint on cement. Look at this everyone, we got science. Science, science. Everything's science. science. So science. let's see how it goes. <laughs> <laughs> this is our test project because we're gonna be using this on a larger scale. <laughs> Nice wing. <laughs> Hello! Meet your mama! When I heard about micro cement from Mav, I was floored. It is so amazing. It's crack proof, waterproof. I'm sure it's gonna go a little bit like taping and mudding at the beginning. I think the fun in micro cement is the fact that you learn and you get good at it. Yeah, I don't think everyone's just an original good at things. No one, who does that? No one. But that's the fun of this. Just like drywall, like you said. Yeah. Ooh, la, la. I like the way you move. I like the things you do. I like it when I'm with you. Yeah. I have to say, I'm very glad that we're getting this experiment in, getting to know the products that we're gonna be using more in depth very soon, and getting a hand at what it's gonna be like working with this material. Damn. It doesn't smell, eh? Wow, this is amazing. I think you're getting the hang of it. It's looking good. I'm so excited to use this more. Can I try? When can I go? Crystal, give me a chance. A scrap piece of plywood and some micro cement? This thing was $800 online. My Pinterest dreams come into life. Look at it. It's so cute. And now all we have to do is sand it, 
do it again and maybe do it a third time if we're being that much perfectionist and then we seal it. And it looks a little like this. Concrete baby, I'm obsessed. It's beautiful. See you Sunday. <laughs>